Last month, we took you to one of the most talked about shops in Pittsburgh. It's called Buck Mason. It's a men's and women's retail store that specializes in classic pieces. It was created in part by Eric Allen Ford, who about six years ago married a Yinzer interior designer Leanne Ford. That union is responsible for another one, the first Buck Mason location in Pittsburgh. Oh, cool. So Katie scored an exclusive tour with Leanne herself. You saw that on PTL last month, but something we haven't dug into the incredible story behind the clothes and their unique Pennsylvania connection. Eric, thank you so much for bringing Buck Mason here to Pittsburgh. Please tell us about this journey. Oh my gosh. Well, you know, we moved here in 2020 and I knew why the family was moving. I didn't know why I was moving, <laughs> but I fell in love with Pittsburgh. I absolutely love it and I love Swickley. And this was just, uh, you know, a labor of love. I wanted to bring what I do here mm -hmm. as well. And also noticed a lot of friends, um, a lot of men especially, that really wanted, uh, you know, a brand like this. They have a need, you know, maybe the, the Pittsburgh Jersey Sunday look with blue jeans and a Steelers jersey isn't necessarily for everybody. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> uh, slowly, Buck Mason has taken a small percentage of the closet, although it's still primarily yellow and black. <laughs> we're, uh, we're getting there. We're getting there. Now, yeah. tell us about your pieces here, because it seems like you have a lot of what would probably be considered like staple pieces within someone's wardrobe. Is that fair to say? Yeah, I mean, we call them modern American classics, and uh, we're really inspired by the greatest products that have ever been built. And so we're constantly deconstructing mm -hmm. iconic uh, classic menswear pieces and then reconstructing uh, them for today. At what point did you find the mill in eastern Pennsylvania? Oh yeah, so a year ago, um, my friend Joe called me and he told me about this factory that was closing in Moton, PA, um, four hours east. And it had actually been operated for 150 years. Wow. Uh, this factory was being built during the Battle of Gettysburg. Wow. In fact, they had to stop product or stop uh, building uh, because some folks had We're to go going fight. To war. Yeah. It was purchased by a company five years ago and mismanaged. Mm. And uh, about a year ago, all of the workers were told that they were going home. So um, we knew that they knew how to build t-shirts yeah. and that's our specialty. Mm -hmm. We've sold over a million t-shirts. This was an opportunity for us to uh, potentially get involved and save the factory, but also serve ourselves and build product. Um, and it's in the water. The people in Moton, PA know how to build t-shirts. Wow. So we brought everyone back and the factory has been running for a year. And most of what you see here was um, built in that factory in Moton, PA. How important is it to you guys to, to come home and to do this? Well, not home for you, but come home where Leanne's from and yeah. do this. Well, I mean, for me, it's just been a, a pleasure. And I, I have to tell you, I didn't know how deep the roots mm -hmm. in Eastern PA around clothing manufacturing were. I mean, in the, in the late 1800s, they supplied all the Eastern department stores, vests, hats, mm -hmm. t-shirts, and uh, so much of that expertise is still there. How has the collaboration with Leanne been? What has this experience been like opening uh, this store, this particular location here in Pittsburgh that involves the both? Yeah, well, she's designed all of our stores and taught me so much about design. So this has just been an extension of that. Um, and it's always a, a collaboration. There's a little bit of give and take. Our styles are very similar, but we have slightly different nuances so it's great to mash them up but one thing we agree on we both love bob dylan <laughs> so you know there are things that uh are right down the middle for both of us and we, we try to focus on those things beautiful thank you so <laughs> much for having us thank you for showing us your beautiful store we're so thrilled that you're here in pittsburgh come on out to buck mason here in swickley on beaver avenue we'll send it back to you guys really cool. I love the style of clothing, but I, I also love the style of the, the shop. Well, obviously, yeah, yeah. They, they know what they're doing. They it's do. So cool. And don't be surprised to see other Buck Mason locations across the country. While Sewickley is store is the one of the newest locations over 30. There are plans for openings in Charleston, South Carolina and a new location in Chicago later this year as well. Yeah.